Okay, coming in the front door, this is the other side of the front door. Have a little nook area right there. This is what your light looks like. Uh, as soon as you walk in, you have this uh, top floor here. Um, it's brown color, pretty cool. Coat closet, mini French doors here. Uh, walk right into the living area with the great room. Fireplace, really open. Uh, vaulted ceilings in here with the recessed lighting. Tracking around, nice fan in the center. Um, all the, they've labeled all the light switches. All the light switches are this format here. Push the button, you know, so that's how that works. So they've labeled everything, probably for people that have come in, but <laughs> there's a lot of switches, so got a lot going on. Looks pretty freshly painted. Everything's really well maintained. The floors are really nice in the area, in the house. Uh, so this is just a, a vent, so you would change that out at your air vent. Like every time the seasons change, you know, change vent, sell all these in the house. Got these sconces in certain places. So, uh, just an open area, got an outlet in the floor here. There's an outlet in the floor over here. So that opens into the sunroom and then off to the left would be the patio. So take a view here of the fireplace. So plenty of built-ins, both sides. These are glass doors. Fireplace is a gas fireplace. There's the key for it. That's where it goes on the floor. It's fake, not real, but there's knobs and stuff where it blows out the heat. Look at the other TV above the mantle. The mantle is just a piece of glass sitting up here on top. It's just remote control for the fan and light. Little gap up there that you could maybe put some stuff. But plenty of uh, shelves here, drawers. Oops, I'll just uh, move this back on there. So looking back to the front door, over here you have a formal dining room and then opens up into the kitchen. It's a big kitchen transition to the same top floor that's when you come in the front door. So you got a really big island here, little sitting area, probably have your table, one side seating, the other side's chairs or whatever. Got these drawers. Whoops, wow, that was kind of loud, sorry. Pull out, fold open. Nice little chair, chair roll treatment. Refrigerator, pantry. Got this nice lighting system. Recessed lights in here as well. With the drop down lights, teardrop, whatever you call them. This is a uh, pretty expensive right here of quoted this out these are several hundred can be up to a thousand dollars they're expensive double oven there's your drip down draft gin air stove gas and there's where it vents out into the crawl space and then it's supposed to exit the house it's not supposed to exit into the crawl space this would be a drawer Pull out, drawer here, outlet, other drawers over here. So the, underneath the sink, dishwasher. These are nice and clean. The drawer down there. Got your dual sink, one food processor, you know, whatever. Soap dispenser. Pull out for the other kind. Looks out the back. Over the little patio back there. Screens on the window. Plenty of lights under the cabinets, above the cabinets, above the sink. Garbage disposal. This one's painted green. Has a little Lazy Susan in here. Everything else pretty standard. Down here in the corner, you have a Lazy Susan in the corner. It's a corner sh shelf. It has the door that kind of is an accordion style door. Get right there so we can close it. Microwave is here. I guess you could put it up there if you wanted to, but they have it down here. A little towel 
holder there. And you put your plates, you know, slide plates in there if you wanted to, whatever. Wine uh, rack above the refrigerator. More shelving next to the fridge. Fridge is in good shape. Side by side. Got a fan in here. It's not very common you have a fan in the kitchen, but you got one in here. Okay, so I'm gonna break it up. Stop this one. 